Okay, children, so this is the continuation of your third uh, video on the chapter Socialism and the Russian Revolution. Okay, so our main topic is the Russian Revolution. So we are trying to understand how this revolution in Russia uh, started. Okay, and we have already read about the background of uh, Russia. Okay, so uh, Russia uh, was a big uh, empire. It was a huge empire, in fact, which was uh, ruled by Tsar Nicholas II. Okay, so the Tsar is the king of Russia. So Tsar Nicholas II was ruling in Russia. All right, and uh, he was uh, very powerful and his empire was mighty. That means it was very, very big. Okay. And uh, we read about how, you know, uh, the political parties were banned during the time of uh, the Tsars. Okay, political parties were uh, illegal to Tsars uh, rule the Russia. Okay, but despite of that, we saw that, you know, revolutionary party, uh, democratic workers party formed by you. Okay, ra you do party ma, you know, peasants they support kareo, revolutionary party lai, ra workers or they were the main force of the Democratic Workers Party, all right, and you uh, political parties lay uh, they were trying to bring reforms or change in the Russian society. So that is what we read in the third video. Okay, now we are going to talk about a very important phase uh, in the Russian history. Okay, and uh, the time period that we are going to focus here is on 1904. Okay, so this uh, 1905 uh, revolution, that is the top topic and uh, this time is called a very turbulent time. Okay, so that means 1905 and uh, this is the preceding year to 1904. Uh, this uh, two years, in fact, it was a very, you know, a turbulent, a very, uh, you know, disturbing time in uh, Russia. Okay, so as you know, Russia was an autocracy, all right, King Le, you know, the Tsar Nicholas II Le, you know, the rule, Gorthio, he had the entire power in his hand, he was an absolute monarch, okay, and the Tsars were not subjected to the parliament, all right, that means Tsars, you know, parliament, okay, that means they did not have to listen to the uh, parliament, okay, Tsars, the king, the entire power, he had the absolute power, okay. So, uh, the liberals, uh, the social democrats and the social revolutionaries that emerged in the Rus uh, Russian society, okay, liberals, uh, social democrats, uh, social revolutionaries, uh, all of these, uh, you know, groups, different groups of people that were living in Russia, they were constantly pressurizing the king, uh, demanding for a constitution. Okay, and in their demand, okay, your liberals, democrats, or revolutionaries, demand much, they were also supported by the nationalist and the jadidist. Okay, now the jadidist, who were these jadidists? This can be a one marks question. So basically, jadidists, you know, Russian Empire, you know, if you remember, I'm the first video, I discussed it with you. Okay, that uh, Russian Empire, ma, different religious groups uh, presided. Okay, majority majority the Orthodox uh, Christians were there. All right, but there were also the Muslims. There were also the uh, you know uh, the other uh, groups of Christianity, Protestants, Catholics, or and even Buddhists were there in the Russian Empire because it was a pretty huge empire. All right, so they were the groups uh, in the Muslim dominated region. Basically, Jani uh, Roche, Russian Empire, Jani Roche, uh, Muslim population, Kiti Jada Thio, Tiani Roche, they were a group of Muslim reformers, okay, uh, within this Russian society. And uh, basically, Unarli Chiki, uh, Unarli support Gati Bandahiri, uh, that, uh, you know, Islam Liche, uh, Russian country Liche. Russia as a country like lead Gonopar. So that is what they felt. Okay, so these a uh, group of Muslim reformers within the Russian society, they were known as the Jadidist. Okay, so remember this, it can come in your one marks questions. All right, so uh, this was the background now. So 1904 was particularly a very bad year for Russia. Okay, and especially for the workers, it was a very, very bad year. Okay, now what we saw is that, you know, uh, the prices of the goods, okay, it became very, very high during this time, okay, but junche wages, junche sa worker ko, eh, the real wages, the actual wages, okay, to check it, it was very, very less and in fact, you keep a decline by you during this time of 1904, 20% decline 
uh, you know uh, was seen in the real wages of the workers okay uh, and uh, because of which you know your problems arise on that hiriche what we saw is that a lot of workers aruche they started to uh, you know become members of the associations okay remember i mean uh, earlier pore ko thyo that workers associations are formed ba ko thyo okay and uh, this workers association ko members it became specially very very high or the membership grew in this association uh, during this period of 1904 okay so bolsheviks and mensheviks hai yo dui tai workers party the ni all right so yo dui tai party ma you know we see we can see that you know the number of workers okay the participants the membership jun chu cha tyo chai it became very very high uh, actually during this year 1904 because the workers were you know surrounded with a lot of crisis unale dere or a problem face ko dethyo okay because of the high prices of goods okay and because of their declining wages okay so that is why 1904 was a bad year for the workers okay now owing to this what happened is that okay is to situation ma che what happened is that uh, four members of the assembly of the russian workers okay so 1904 ma yo jun je russian worker ko jun je assembly cha tesko jun je char jana members sa okay they were uh, dismissed okay and at the putel of iron works okay so this workers who were working in this putel of iron works okay so ya kaam garne char jana jun je members so who were uh, charge and junche workers sir, who were actually the members of the assembly of russian workers which was founded in 1904 so they were dismissed when they go unala kaam bar ki gar dio nikali dio okay and after this you know there was a call for industrial action that means after this workers ki bhai they became very very angry and you know they came out in the st- uh, streets revolting against the uh, decision that was made so some 1 lakh 10000 workers they went on a strike in st petersburg okay so st petersburg or moscow che these were mainly the centers of industries okay so industries are jada tar moscow or st petersburg mai located the okay so jada tar workers haru pani yahi ni rune thyo so jab yo char jana workers haru achanak dismiss garyo all these workers you know they came out in support uh, you know revolting against the decision that was passed okay ra you know unale milera ki gore strike call garyo okay and these workers they were demanding for uh, you know three main things one is reduction in the working hours okay kaam garne jun che you know hours factories ma it was very very long it used to be very very long okay so you know 12 to 14 hours they were working All right. So workers' or main demand, chicky, the one that the demand was very, very basic and simple. Okay. The first thing was that working hours, which is one, could you reduce one person to eight hours? Okay. The second thing was that the wages, which is a decline, one that you the wages, when you one person increase one person. And the third thing was that the working condition, okay, in the factories, the working conditions, it was horrible. Okay, terrible thing. All right. So these workers demanded that you know, junche unar ko work karne condition cha, okay? Ah, uh, work karne junche you know condition cha factories ma, tu pini ke unbar sa better uno parcha. So all these workers they came out uh, launching the strikes, okay? And uh, they began to raise their demands, the three demands, okay? And this procession, you know, jo junche workers ko junche procession theo, okay? This procession was led by, okay? The leader of this procession was. father gepon okay you can see the picture here okay father gepon was the main person okay just like you procession of workers okay the angry workers ko procession okay who were demanding for uh, you know better working condition increasing wages okay and reduction in the working uh, uh, working hours okay so two workers the lead karne person je father gepon the okay so you procession the layer uh, father gepon he went to the winter palace where the zars resided okay but there what happened is that these procession okay you jun che workers ko procession tha that procession was attacked okay by the cossacks and the police okay ra king le ke order gar yo processions you know esili aera una king ko palace ko agari demand ru garda khere che you know king le tela suppress garna ko lagi che what did he do he sent you know he attacked in fact uh, yo jun che workers ru cha the workers ko procession was attacked by the police and the cossacks okay so cossacks pane ko they are basically the armed uh, or the armies uh, that uh, came on horses okay so i've seen, shown you the pictures also so you know russian empire ko cossacks ru hunthyo so these cossacks and police were sent to suppress the workers 
okay, and suppress the demands that were the workers were raising outside the king's uh, winter palace. All right. So in this uh, attack, if you see, uh, 100 workers were killed and over 300 wounded. Okay, thin so jana the wounded boy, about hundred people, you know, hundred workers jo leje procession ma join gari ko thiyo, they were killed in this procession. Okay, okay, and there was a lot of bloodshed as you see, you know, yani hundred workers ro they were killed bande sir, three hundred were wounded bande sir, na so it it turned out to be very very violent. Okay, there was a lot of bloodshed. Okay, everywhere there was blood. Okay, and incidentally yo Sunday yo you know procession la father ki pon le lead gari ko thiyo. Okay, so this uh, particular incident chunche boy yo. This is called the Bloody Sunday. You incident like that, Bloody Sunday, Bonera, uh, you know, a bunch of okay. And uh, after this incident of Bloody Sunday, okay, a series of events took place all over Russia, and this came to be known as the 1905 Revolution. Okay, so your incident of Bloody Sunday, like that, everywhere, you know, workers or you know, they uh, came out to revolt. Okay, it sparked a revolution all over. Okay, so you can see the picture here. Okay, Father Gipon Leji is here, you know, Winter Palace Gogari is here, procession lead Karigutu, and this procession was attacked by the Cossacks and the police. Okay, because of which it turned out to be uh, full of bloodshed. Okay, and uh, Bloody Sunday, Bane, you incident, Le Bancho. You Bloody Sunday incident, Ko Bad Mache, everywhere in Russia. Thupro, you know, series of events, you know, it started to take place. Okay, and these series of events, like, yeah, amile, 1905 revolution, bancha, okay. So, strikes took place all over the countries, okay. Uh, universities, uh, they were closed down, okay. Student bodies, uh, bani, okay, students, ko unions, uh, organizations, uh, bani, they walked out in the, uh, you know, street, okay, and they were complaining about the lack of civil liberties, okay, uh, civilians, or the common people, kuma, they don't have any kind of, free, uh, you know, freedom. So, they were basically complaining about the lack of freedom that the civilians or the people of Russia have, all right. So, uh, lawyers, doctors, engineers, and the other middle class workers, or the, even they start started to form you know this kind of unions of unions unalipani form gunno thale okay so earlier workers unions the peasants or unions the okay but now you know even all this you know employed people or just the lawyers doctors engineers eh? and all these middle class class workers or these also started to establish the union of unions and all of these you know protest much eh? there was one common demand and that was demand for a constituent assembly they were all demanding that now russia much a constituent assembly form no parcha okay now because of these kind of you know events that were taking place or because of this 1905 revolution the czar okay that is nicholas ii he you know allowed creation of an elected consultative parliament or Duma. Okay, so Duma again. What is Duma? One marks question. Ma akuthiyo paila pini. It is the Russian Parliament. Okay, Russian Parliament. Lamle like Duma banera bancha. Okay, so 1905 revolution ko baad ma je zar le people like you know abo you know unako demands like you know uh, or your your revolution like you know stop korno ko lagi je. Uh, you know he agreed that okay now uh, a parliament ke unche form unche Russia ma. Okay, and this is known as Duma. Now. Um, after this formation of the uh, parliament, okay, Russian Duma or you know the consultative parliament formed by Pachi, uh, the you know Tsar, uh, he passed a decision that Jatipuni trade unions, sir, Jatipuni factory committees, Rujunche formed back the revolution ko time ma, okay, they were all declared illegal. All right, so agadi uh, chhe you know revolution la stop you know uh, parliament la agree kare, you know parliament la ule create kare. Okay, but soon after the formation of the parliament, uh, you know Tsar, uh, the king, okay, he decided, okay, he passed the decision that jati pani 1905 revolution ko time jati pani big and small trade unions and factory committees are formed back. So they were all again declared illegal. Okay, and he also passed severe restrictions on public activity okay but the public activity mapping that means gathering demonstrations or rallies or mapping you know uh, thupro restrictions or abo impose on a boy okay 75 days uh, you know after the first duma was uh, you know formed so first duma formed by 75 days money uh, zar little dismiss karyo second duma pani you know formed by okay it was re-elected uh, re within three months but even that was dismissed okay and uh, jab, uh, third duma formed by 
Okay, the third Duma Mache, uh, you know, all the voting laws or my changes layer. Okay, King Lee voting laws or change career. Okay, and basically, the third Duma Mache, he only you know kept uh, members who were specially conservative politicians. Okay, remember, I'm the conservatives, so conservatives were basically the kind of you know the social groups who did not or who were not in favor of change. So, like change, you know, which change ko khilafthiyo. that means they did not want changes. All right, so Zars uh, Lepini ki gari banda ki ni third Duma la third Duma jab a form bhaiyo to third Duma ma chhe ulle khali jo conservative people or chhe ya conservative politicians or chhe khali unar la mati ki gariyo milaira he formed the third Duma. The liberals and the revolutionaries they were not allowed in this parliament. So uh, this is what happened after the 1905 revolution so, uh, let's look at the next topic so the next topic is again first world war and the russian empire so here we are going to read about uh, you know the first world war and how did the first world war or what impact did the first world war have on the russian empire okay so as uh, you know you may know the first world war started in 1914 and it continued till 1918 so first world war you know it was fought for a very long period okay now this first world war was basically fought between two uh, very big alliances in europe okay so that's why european junje you know europe ma junje jati pani countries haru cha ya jati pani you know empires haru cha they were basically divided into two groups dui ta group ma baateko thyo so one was the central powers okay now central powers bhanne bhanne pachi esma germany uh, austria hungary and turkey it included that then the other group was triple alliance now triple alliance bhanne pachi it was an alliance of three main uh, play, uh, countries that is France, Britain and Russia. So the first world war was between these two groups in uh, Europe. Okay, Europe ko yoh duita thulo thulo factions, yoh thulo thulo junche groups form bako cha. Yoh duita group ko beech ma cha yoh first world war bako thi. Now why do we call it a world war? Because this war ma cha khali Europe ko yoh countries ya yoh empires or ma involved thi na. Okay, there were many other countries also that were involved in the first world war indirectly so kasari indirectly bhayo just they abo you know uh, france britain russia germany these were all very very powerful uh, nations or empire in europe okay Ra, all these you know nations ko ke all these empires okay you all these you know big big uh, european powers or ko uh, asia ma africa ma ke thi colonies haru thyo all right just they for example uh, india was under the British rule. So, we were the British colony. Alright. So, when the first world war, you can see Britain was also involved in the first world war. Okay. The Britain involved because India was under the British rule. Okay. Because we were a British colony, we were also dragged in the first world war. Okay. So, that's why world war. Because basically, all the countries of the world no, you know they were directly or indirectly involved in this war and it lasted from 1914 to 1918 okay so i hope this is clear to you all right so first world war russian empire was also there okay and it was uh, on which side it was on the side of the triple alliance and fighting along with france and britain against whom the central powers central powers when you go germany austria hungary and turkey is it clear now let's see russia during the first world war so initially uh, the people of uh, russia they supported the war okay because it was their empire that was in the first world war people were very very supportive okay the army was also very very supportive okay so that's why you know first first much russia was making initial gains okay first first much it was you know progressing in the first world war that means unako performance ramrothyo okay but what happened is that uh, the Tsar, okay, Nicholas II, he refused to consult with the main parties in Duma. Okay, so Bistari Bisa King Niki Goryo, he you know he did not uh, feel necessary to consult with the other parties. Okay, and uh, you know people felt that you know the king is not considerate. Okay, king lechi people like considerate kare ko chayna, people ko opinion le ko chayna, or parties ko opinion le ko chayna. Okay, so tell you like what happened is as the war progressed, the war progressed, the war you know, 
त्यति नै के हुँदै गयो सपोर्ट के हुँदै गयो इट वर थिन भनेको कम्ती हुँदै हुँदै गयो ओके सो फर्स्टमा एकदम बेसी पिपलले सपोर्ट गर्दै थियो यु नो पिपल वेयर ओभर द सपोर्ट फ्रम द पिपल वाज ओभर वेलमिङ ओके बट एज द वर प्रोग्रेस ओके के भयो द सपोर्ट अफ द पिपल वर थिन ओके कमन पिपलले यसलाई यु नो सपोर्ट गर्नु छोड्यो बिस्तारी बिस्तारी सो एज द वर प्रोग्रेस ओके पिपलको सपोर्ट पनि कम्ती कम्ती हुँदै गयो ओके र एन्टी जर्मन सेन्टिमेन्ट्स इट र्यान भेरी हाई द्याट मिन्स एन्टी जर्मन सेन्टिमेन्ट्स भनेको यु नो द हेट्रेड अफ पिपल अगेन्स्ट जर्मनी बिकज इट वाज देयर एनिमी इट बि इट बिकेम भेरी भेरी हाई ओके सो मच द्याट उनीहरूले सेन्ट पिटर्सबर्ग लाई उनीहरूले यो नामलाई चेन्ज गरेर उनीहरूले के गरिदियो पेट्रोग्राड गरिदियो ओके किन भन्दाखेरि बिकज सेन्ट पिटर्सबर्ग वाज अ जर्मन नेम ओके र दे हेटेड जर्मनी सो मच द्याट उनीहरूले सेन्ट पिटर्सबर्ग यो जर्मन नेम हो यो हामीले चलाउनु हुँदैन भनेर त्यो नेमलाई उनीहरूले के गरिदियो रिप्लेस गरिदियो एज पेट्रो ग्राड ओके द जरिन एलेक्जेन्ड्रिया जर्मन ओरिजिन्स एन्ड द पोअर एडभाइजर स्पेसियली अ मङ्क कल रासपुटिन मेड द अटोक्रेसी अनपपुलर ओके द्याट मिन्स अटोक्रेसी द किङलाई ही बिकेम मोर एन्ड मोर अनपपुलर ओके बिकज जुन चाहिँ किङको जुन चाहिँ वाइफ थियो जरिन ओके सी ह्या सी वाज अफ अ जर्मन ओरिजिन ओके ऊ एक्चुअली कहाँको थियो जर्मनीको थियो अल राइट सो बिकज अफ द्याट यू नो बिकज जर्मनी वाज देयर एनिमी ओके पिपल हेटेड द क्विन अल्सो all right the entire family was seen as uh, you know supporters of germany all right so tell you that here your king family okay the czars also the king also he started to become very very unpopular so uh, the first world war on the eastern front was different than the western front okay so as you know russia was fighting the war from the uh, you know eastern front eastern border okay and also from the western border ओके न यो दुईटै साइडमा हेऱ्यो भने यु नो द फाइटिङ स्ट्राटेजी ओके वर्ल्डमा जुन चाहिँ फाइट गर्ने स्ट्राटेजी एकदमै के थियो डिफ्रेन्ट थियो ओके वेस्टमा हेऱ्यो भने आर्मिजहरू दे मोस्टली फट फ्रम ट्रेन्चेस न ट्रेन्चेस भनेको के हो दिज आर टनल्स यु नो खड्डा यु नो हुन्छ नि होइन सो द पिपल द सोल्जर्सहरू त्यसमा लुकेर उनीहरूले के गर्छ फाइट गर्छ नि अल राइट सो आर्मिज बेसिकली फट फ्रम द ट्रेन्चेस ओके वेस्टर्न बर्डरमा चाहिँ वेस्टर्न साइडमा चाहिँ वेस्टर्न फ्रन्टमा चाहिँ आर्मिजहरू चाहिँ ट्रेन्चेसबाट के गर्थ्यो उनीहरू के गर्थ्यो फाइट गर्थ्यो ओके विच वाज स्ट्रेच्ड अलङ्ग द इस्टर्न फ्रान्स वेर एज इस्टर्न फ्रन्टमा चाहिँ मोस्टली द आर्मिज वेयर अन फुट ओके उनीहरू यु नो फुट बाई फुट उनीहरू के गर्दै थियो अघि बढ्दै थियो ओके एन्ड उनीहरू धेरै अघि नै बढिसकेको थियो ओके बट वेस्टर्न साइड होस् या इस्टर्न साइड होस् यु नो यो दुईटै यु नो साइडमा द रसियन आर्मी ओके दे वेयर यु नो सफरिङ मेनी क्याजुअलिटिज द्याट मिन्स अ लट अफ यु नो सोल्जर्स वेयर यु नो सोल्जर्स वेयर लुजिङ देयर लाइफ यु नो थाउजन्ड्स एन्ड मिलियन्स अफ सोल्जर्स दे लस देयर लाइफ ओके सो दुईटै साइडबाट द डिफिट वाज सकिङ ओके दे ह्याड नट थट द्याट यु नो दे वुड बी डिफिटेड अल राइट एन्ड इट वाज अल्सो डिमोरलाइजिङ ओके डिमोरलाइज द आर्मी वाज यु नो टायर दे वेर यु नो फाइटिङ फर सच अ लङ पिरियड बट यु नो दे वेर नट गेटिङ एनिथिङ यु नो दे वेर नट गेनि गेनिङ एनिथिङ ओके केही सक्सेस उनीहरू भएको थिएन ओके सो इट वाज भेरी भेरी डिमोरलाइजिङ ओके उनीहरूको मोरल पनि के हुँदै थियो डाउन हुँदै थियो All right now uh, the condition of russia 1914 to 1917 okay because the russian army was you know losing very badly against germany and austria uh, there were around 7 million casualties by 1917 you know by the end of the first world war 7 million casualties you know 7 million people you know and uh, soldiers had lost their life russian armies you know about because of the fear of losing eh you know they knew that they were losing okay and soon ke huncha the areas will be taken over by the सेन्ट्रल पावर्स है जर्मनी र अस्ट्रेलिया उनीहरूलाई के गर्दैछ हराउँदैछ है अघि बढ्दैछ उनीहरूको सोल्जर्सहरू चाहिँ होइन सो दे फियर द्याट यु नो उनीहरूको ल्यान्ड विल बी टेकन ओभर बाई देम ओके सो रसियन आर्मिजले के गऱ्यो भन्दाखेरि उनीहरूले जति पनि क्रप्स छ ओके इन द एरियाज जहाँनिर उनीहरू लुज गर्दै गयो त्यो एरियाजहरूमा उनीहरूले जति पनि क्रप्सहरू छ के गर्दियो त्यो डिस्ट्रोय गरिदियो वाट एभर बिल्डिङ्सहरू थियो है वाट एभर यु नो यु नो फ्याक्ट्रिजहरू थियो दे वे अल डिस्ट्रोइड सो द्याट त्यो चाहिँ एनिमीको हातमा नजाओस् भनेर 
Did you understand? Uh, so all these areas, you know, uh, you know, crops are destroyed by you, you know, buildings are destroyed by you, you know, factories are destroyed by you. All those area people are by they became refugees. Okay, refugees. Refugees are people basically jo ki unja homeless unja because of war uh, like situation nikada. Okay, so three million people, you know, they became refugees in Russia. Okay, uh, and the soldiers now they were so tired, they were so demotivated, you know, because of the defeat that you know they had now no wish or they had no interest to fight such a war. Is to halke war jani do nala ke faidai baako chahiye na, and that's been going on and on for so many years. They were not tired of this war. Okay, so unako jati pani you know enthusiasm thi paila, hey, beginning ma just to halke energy thi, thi pani it was now dying. Okay, and they had no wish. Uh, you know, or they did not wish to fight uh, this war, okay? And as you know, crops are destroyed by you, hey? crops destroy you, you know, people homeless, uh, you know, there were another problem, that problem was shortage of food, okay? And this again led to food riots, okay? What happened? The common people, you know, uh, you know people started to fight for food, Okay, especially, you know, women or, you know, bread shops or kobairo, you know, people used to stand in queues to uh, get, uh, you know, a piece of bread. Okay, and this uh, lagi pani dhere ki unte fight unte. So, there was a lot of food riots. There was a short, lot of, you know, shortage of food. Uh, you know, soldiers were wounded, demotivated. So many people had become homeless. They had become refugees. So many had become orphans. So many had become widows. Okay, and basically this was the situation of or condition of Russia during the time of war. That is from 19. 14 to 1917 okay so the war has not ended till now okay 17 summon war sakiko china it is still you know continuing continuing okay but now the people do not have any zeal okay unako make energy ke enthusiasm china to fight this war okay now let us talk about the impact of first world war on the industries okay russian industries already you know russian industries jada thina okay it was only in pockets eh? few places amate russian industries already in fact rest of europe banda russia ma industries aru dherai ke thyo kam thi thyo okay now let's see impact ke bhayo world le garda hiri okay now uh, uh, cut off from other suppliers of industrial goods okay russia was cut off from other suppliers of industrial goods as you know you know it was being defeated okay the army uh, from germany and austria was taking uh, you know taking over the russian empire from all sides okay so tile gada hiri ki bhayo jati pani you know russia bitro bairo bada aune jati pani you know industrial goods haru cha because russia chai ke thyo they did not have many industries of their own okay so unale ke garnu parcha they had to bring industrial products from outside right that means aru countries le russia ma ke garthyo import garthyo okay but war le garda khiri okay because they were now you know stranded they were surrounded with enemies they were cut off from the supply okay aru jaga bada industrial goods haru russia bitro aunu ke bhayo band hundai gayo okay uh, industrial equipments disintegrated more rapidly jati pani industries haru cha okay industrial equipments haru cha te ke hundai gayo disintegrate okay jan destroy hundai gayo okay and 1916 my fisi railway lines also broke down okay so railway lines that was a very important uh, connection between different places of russia okay the railway lines pani ke hundai gayo break hundai gayo so tele gada ke the connectivity between the people okay and the huge empire in russia in russia ko jun chai huge empire just like your railways like you know connect karthyo that connectivity was also broken okay and another problem was now there was shortage of labor shortage of labor because to fight the war you know so many young you know men or abled men right that means men who were you know uh, physically and mentally you know uh, able to right? fight healthy to all right they had all gone to fight the war okay the first world war all right so now uh, this men had because the men had gone out to fought, fight in the war uh, there was a shortage of labor in the industries okay so this is how you know war le garda khiri you know uh, russia ko you know politics uh, society ma mate impact bhayo na russia ko economy was also impacted okay that means the economy of russia also had to suffer because of the first world war so i hope you have understood this much